Hi friends, this is Lila. Welcome to my channel Lila Webdev. In this video, we will see how to resolve the conflicts when we raise a pull request. Normally, what I can say is, for example, we have a feature branch and we are raising a pull request. For example, see, so let's take any, any repository. So, git clone. Assume that we are having two branches, master and main. So, now main is a default branch, right? So, let's assume that we create a branch something like bug fix okay so this is a branch that we have created and now when we do the changes here we need to raise pr to the main why because this is a feature branch we have did the uh, job so whatever the uh, code we need to do so we have done so now our code need to be merged into the main so what we need to do main or master whatever the branch now what we need to do we need to raise the pull request to where to the main so we will raise the pull request now in between this raising that pull request so now in between not in between so now you took the branch from the main and you did whatever the code you want you did so in between this period of time so it may take two days three days or one week or one month so whatever it may no, normally it will not take one month so may normally it may take one day two days or max one week so if you have a feature branch now what you will try to do in between this time the main has updated so main has updated means it has been updated with some other feature branches so that means you will be having a lot of team members so for example if you are having a 10 team members working so each team member will be working on on one new feature so each will be creating a branch from the main and they are doing their respective work now what will happen is now you you are raising a request now you want to raise the pull request in between this period of time somebody some other team members also has completed their work and they have already raised the pull request in between this period of time and now they their pull request has also been merged into the main okay so merged into the main means so the, their pull request means they got their they got their feature code approved so they have uh, they have got the approved of their feature branch and now that code has been up, updated into the main so that means main has an updated code that means the new feature has been updated into the main code you you didn't know about this one so main main the main got updated you didn't know and you are working with the old main whatever the uh, branch you have created from the main branch so that in that branch only you are working so unfortunately you think that so you worked on the file you have updated one file in the same scenario the in the main also the file got updated in the same way so now you got a conflict so the github will not able to re realize that which which code i need to take so already in the main it has the updated code but this guy also the feature branch also got updated with a new code which which you, which code i need to take it so it will it will raise the conflict so now we need to uh, we need to resolve the conflict and we need to update the pull request so how we can do this one let's try to see so here we have a bug fix right so now let's try to take the main branch now let's go to the git clone so i am going to cd git hyphen clone i took i already took the clone of this one okay so now here let's try to take git fetch so I am fetching so the new branch so I got the new branch bug fix which I have created from the github now let's try to check the branches what are the branches I am having so we are having bug fix main and master so let's think that main is our default branch so main branch so we are here we are having the index.txt so let's switch back to the bug fix okay so I switch it to the bug fix now let's assume that I am working on the index.txt file okay so here we don't have anything so i am writing something like hi lila web dev something something code i am trying to do okay i have added here so i am committing the code so changes done okay so just i have committed the code i i i, I didn't raise any pull request for this one so changes has been done now what what will happen now let's try to see so here so if i try to see the code okay here if I try to see the code now, now the main we are having right in the main somebody came and somebody updated the code so right now I am updating through here so I as we don't have any other user so I am the only user here so for the demo purpose I am doing so here the code updated from main so in the same index.txt file so it has been updated somebody has updated this code so in the main we have an updated code let's assume so this code this updated code we don't have with us in the in this branch so now let's try to push this one so git push i am pushing this code what is the bug fix code bug fix code whatever the bug fix i have in the index.txt file so i am committing this code 
So now let's try to check it here. So where is that one? Yeah, now let's try to check it here. So now here bug fix had a recent changes. So compare and raise the pull request. Yeah, okay, fine. So I will raise the pull request. So I need I need my change to be entered into the main. So when I am when I am pushing this one, okay, when I am pushing this one into the main, see here you will be able to see that can't automatically merge. So here GitHub is trying to check whether 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 this bug fix can be automatically merged into the main or not. So this can't be merged. Don't worry, you can still create the pull request. Okay. So now here. So maybe so I have fixed the bug. Please merge it to main. So I am writing some comments and I am raising a pull request. Now here, what it what it has raised? So now the pull request has been raised. Now here you will be able to see that this branch has conflicts that must be resolved. So now I can't merge, I can't directly merge this branch. What is that branch? This bug fix branch into the main branch. So this, this has come some conflicts. So please resolve this conflicts it is saying. So here you will be able to see that in the GitHub desktop you can buy this. This is the normal desktop software or otherwise command line instructions also you will be able to see. So here these are the command line instructions. So check out hyphen b. This is the old syntax. So we can take this what we can say is switch command so that it will automatically map this local repository bug fix to the remote bug fix. So now git merge main. So let's try to see. So normally how we will do the merging concept. So like that only we can do it. So now here let's go let's merge the master into the bug fix. So I am merging git merge master. So I am merging it here. Sorry git merge main sorry git merge main. So now it is telling that already up to date. So what I need to do so it's already up to date means so I didn't took the update the main code I didn't took it. So let's switch back to the main. So now here let's pull it pull the changes. So recent changes what are the changes we have got it. So I have I have edited the file index.txt if I did. So now we got the update. Now let's switch back to the bug fix. Okay. So now what I can do is so let's git merge main. So I am merging the main. Okay, what has happened? So we have pulled the changes, right? So git switch main. So we have got the changes. VA index.txt file. So sorry, we didn't get any changes. So maybe what I did. So here we are in the git clone and I am in the code. So I am in the master so update index.vatxt. So here we are having the code, the code updated from main. Fine. So this is the main git remote hyphen v. So we are having this one same only. So oh, I am in the main. Okay. So I will pull the changes. Already updated the same. Okay. So va index.txt. Let's try to check. So nothing changes are not coming. So now what we can check git status we try to check this with the, oh so this main branch is with the origin master okay so now what is this type of scenarios will come so now it is with that local main branch is in with the what did he say with the origin master so what I can do is git pull hyphen u origin main so I am so I am doing it push hyphen u origin main something like that. So let's try to check it. So rejected. So this main main. Okay. So now we will check the status or otherwise. So it is. So now what I can do is. So here. So we need to set it to the main. So now what I can do is. So git pull origin main. So I can pull the changes from origin main. So here we got the update and here i need to check it so we got the updated code so now here we if you want you can git set hyphen sorry set hyphen upstream okay so sorry i have written some wrong so here i have written wrong so now what i can do is wait is not moving yeah so now here git set git branch okay git branch hyphen hyphen set upstream and we can give something like origin slash main so we can give like this i think fail to say is no longer so please use 
hyphen hyphen track or hyphen hyphen okay fine we'll use hyphen hyphen track then okay for demo work. so now it is set to the main so now if you try to check the status okay so it is set to the branch main so now we can pull the changes okay we can pull the changes not a problem so already up to date so fine so now what i will try to do so i will switch back to bug fix okay so now here i will merge the main so merge main here so now we got the conflicts here okay so we got the conflicts so now what is the conflict so if we try to check the git status so here is the modified file so va index.txt so this is the code so we can remove this one all so i want to keep both the changes so i will keep this one and i will remove this all code and i will remove sorry yeah so i will keep it like this only for the time being yeah i will save it so i can add everything and i can commit hyphen m so resolve conflicts okay so now i have resolved it i will push it git push okay so now if i try to push it so what will happen let's try to see so now we have pushed it yeah successfully now what i will do here i will try to check this one so where is the pull request this is our pull request and here if i try to do changes done so now it has checking for ability yeah now see it has came to green color so now it will be able to merge so here you will be able to see my commits also so here you will be able to see my commits so changes done and the resolve conflicts resolve conflicts is the thing what which i have resolved the conflicts now what i will try to do here i will try to confirm merge so i will confirm the merge so this is a normal process only and if you want you can delete the branch bug fix branch and here if you to go to the code and in the main you will be able to see both the changes so hi lila web and this code is updated from main both the changes you will be able to see and if i want i can go back to git switch main here okay and if i try to see the ls you will be having this one so now if i try to check vi index.txt now you have only one line so if i pull those changes from here now you will be able to see the update c so now we have got the update and if i try to check this vi index.txt oh sorry why is it in game so now git status so let's try to check so now nothing is oh is ahead so git pull git pull origin main okay so oh sorry git pull origin main so i am pulling here so now if i try to check git status sorry git not git status vi index.txt so now see we are able to get the output so this is how we will be able to merge the conflicts so hope you understood about this merging the uh, resolving the conflicts uh, when the pull when we raise the pull request when we get the conflicts so this is how we will be resolving the conflicts hope you understood about this one little bit of confusing why because my repository my local branch is pointing to some other branch normally my our local branch will point to the main branch only so if your local branch is pointing to other remote branch means so like this you will be having so no need to worry you will be having the same thing like that only so if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you